Okay, hello, how you doing? Mike here. Um, I think it's real progress. Uh, got the pan on last night. Today we're gonna put in the lifters. Uh, these are just uh, some Summit Racing, um, just standard lifters. Uh, they're not hydraulic. Or no, excuse me, they're not, uh, shoot, I forgot the term. Anyways, they're, they're, I can't think of it, the flat tappet type. So, okay. okay, we're putting in the lifters right now. I'll give you some close-up view here. Okay. That help? Yeah. Okay, so putting in the lifters. Uh, basically, it just calls for some lube. Um, and basically, some lube on the lifters. And from what I can tell, there's a little hole. See, in this brand, these are brand new lifters. Uh, you can, there's a little hole on the side, so I'm assuming that's where the oil gets squirt it onto the lifter itself or something like that hmm. anyways it doesn't really tell you about alignment and all that but I'm gonna line go ahead and line those two up so okay so first off let's uh, let's get her going here all right I'm gonna put a little bit of so there's my two steps here I'm gonna I've got my got my uh, Royal Purple's uh, engine lube, and then I got my my Molly paste. Okay. Now, all right. So I'm gonna put a little bit of the Molly. Okay. Okay. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put Molly around this area first. Okay, so I put I put some lube around it, and then I'm also going to put uh, the Molly paste right on, right on the head here, just a little bit. You know, I don't think you want they want the Molly paste on the sides here. So, all right, let's do this. I'm going to put the whole roll this way. Okay. Okay, I'm sure you, I'm sorry. I'm not really showing you what I'm doing here. I'm just putting on the uh, right there, just on the edge. Give it a little trick here so I don't get my finger all full of the the Molly paste when I want to go when when I go to coat the. I'm just putting on a little napkin here and and dabbing it on. So I'll be reusing this. I guess it doesn't. You want to be, I guess, as liberal as possible with this because this is going to be that initial. It's going to need something initially. Okay. And I'm just, there's a hole on the left here, so I'm just matching up 
that hole. I can feel they're hidden. Okay. You know, I should probably look that up. The book didn't say anything about the hole on the side. Maybe it's nothing. But, uh... I'm trying to figure out what it's there for. Maybe it goes the opposite direction to coat the other side of the wall. I'm gonna look that up real quick. I'll be back. Hello, I'm back. Uh, I just wanted to give you, I just found some more information now. See that little hole on the side of the lifter? Okay. Some people on the internet were saying it doesn't matter. But for most part, what I read, some people were saying that. For most part, I, I read that to, to, to put it towards the, the valley here, so port, pointing it upwards. And basically, what it is is a. Um, it's for uh, air bleed out, and um, and it'll keep the uh, from ticking before they get primed again by the oil system. need much with this simple fact it's just it, it's so thick that it just just a little bit has it contains a lot of the lubricant so. and then I don't know just I'm just putting after I do that I just put a little bit in the center This is just for initial anyway. Okay, second box out of the way.
Appreciate you guys with me and watching me. And I'm going to probably put up some better videos later. Um, I got some ideas that I want to do. And because uh, I, I, I kind of do a lot of different things. Uh, I like working on different, different, different projects for my other car and uh, not just car related stuff. Um, I wanted to get into a little bit of the hydrogen production, uh, HHO production through electrolysis. That's kind of, that's fascinating me for years though. So I've been thinking about doing that. So hopefully, um, I'll get some more videos up here for you to watch. Most of them are going to be technical of some sort. But I'll probably put up videos of uh, what I do for a living, and that's I do PC repair and uh, website design. So um, most likely I'll put videos of that. So um, that I can definitely tell you um, there won't be a lot of what's going on here. <laughs> a lot of stuff I don't know. But um, those videos would definitely be real helpful for you guys. Okay, guys, I'm going to go ahead and uh, uh, I'll go ahead and I'll get this finished up and I will see you tomorrow. But uh, Bakes, thing, same procedure, each one, and I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, thank you.